and its U.S. pharma watchdog, uh, which has really kept these companies on their toes. We are talking about Cadillac, Lupin and Alembic. Ekta Batra joins us with the details. Ekta, today the day clearly belongs to the pharma sector. Well, yes, it was raining regulatory action for a lot of the pharma companies in today's trading session. I'll start with Lupin, where uh, they did inform the exchanges that uh, the US FDA has inspected the company's Dabasa facility, which is basically an API manufacturing facility. It was inspected from 29 June to around the 6th of J July with around 243s that were issued. The inspection, however, was classified as voluntary action indicated, which means that um, basically Basically, the US FDA is quite satisfied with the observations and uh, the interaction that they possibly had with the management at the end of it, and hence they would not need to reinspect the plant for them to get further approvals from there. Separately, we had Cadilla, which uh, informed the exchanges that they have received an establishment inspection report from the US FDA for its Moriah facility. This is, however, for observations which date back to August to September 2014, and the warning letter which they had received in December of 2015 still stands outstanding, which is something that they're still resolving. And I do understand from my sources separately that the remediation measures for Cadilla's Mariah plan is expected to be completed by the end of July. Lastly, Alembic also informed the exchanges that they have received an establishment inspection report or a closure report from uh, uh, the US FDA for their API facility in Karkadi, which was in fact inspected in April of 2015. All right. All